Ladies and gentlemen, these are the most advanced pop smartphones in the world. This is Galaxy S6 and Galaxy S6 Edge. So today Samsung showed us for the first time the Galaxy S6 Edge. I actually did a whole entire video on all the things it can do and reasons why it's different, but aside from just looking cool, why would you actually want the Edge on both sides of the display? Well, for one thing, they have specific features dedicated to it. One of the things is always near where your thumb is on the display to bring in your contacts, and that's called People Edge. Another thing is, when you get an incoming call, it'll actually notify you uh, with the side of the display facing you. So little things take advantage of the fact that you can see the display from the side. Also, fun fact, if you're receiving a call and you don't want to answer it, you can just hold your finger right on the IR sensor on the back, and it'll send a, sorry, I can't answer message. Another thing it does is when you're facing up, it'll, well, since it's an AMOLED display, not light any of the pixels except for the time. So you can use it as an alarm clock and it'll sort of dimly show you what time it is at night. But something really cool that I found that might not ever be mentioned on stage or in any of their presentations is the fact that so many apps, Android apps right now, take advantage of a little swipe in from the side. And that drawer on the side, which shows up in the Google Play app and Google Play Music and Google Play Movies and Hangouts and a whole bunch of other stuff, Gmail, Inbox, stuff like that, all takes a swipe in from right at that spot where the glass curves. And I kind of thought, as I was playing with it, that seems perfectly natural. I actually kind of thought this could have been the main phone and not an accessory. And Samsung would also release the Galaxy S6 as a sort of a safety net. I like it that much. Uh, the display is already gorgeous, but we've seen things like watching videos on it and using all of the rest of Samsung's apps in a normal way feels fine, but it's sort of a nice touch that you can use that side glass for a way that you don't really see on stage. Something you don't notice until you've used it. Worth knowing.